go to the room. Huh? Mm -hmm. To the room again? Mm -hmm. oh, wait, can't you see my eyes are closing? You know? Go to the room again now. You won't kill me? Of course not. You know you are mine. Oh. Just can't oh. get enough of oh. you. Baby, oh. Mm. Why, why, why is this? Why is it that? See, I'm so surprised the way this guy keeps disturbing you. Maybe he's yet to come with the times that you're gone. Exactly. He is not only broke but also foolish. I think his current situation has also affected his middle of Langata. I mean, it's been months that I stopped taking his calls. I have been avoiding him. Common sense should have ministered to him to move on rather than draining my battery on a daily basis. Oh. I call this kind of people, if we can't say more, oh yeah, call him to tell him that he should stop calling you. Since he doesn't have sense, let him keep disgracing his generation. It is only people with dead brains that do not understand things that are staring at them. Oh. I don't understand. Are you are you thinking that is a is a dog that is barking and following? Is a human being? I've been calling you. I'm not going to even be more again. James, what is my business with you? Eh? Hey man. Don't you know your your level in this in this community again? See, let me warn you. Don't you ever in your life stop me on the way or even call my name. Better go and look for something to do with your life and stop being in a village nuisance. Okay, okay, you idiot. You are a very, very big feminine idiot. Look at this. If anybody that calls you idiot, say thank you, sir. Eh? Go and tell that to your useless brother at home, this thing you are telling me. And when there is no member of your family that, 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 that is better, better, better than me, sir, you are here talking rubbish. I want to organize you well so that you, you look like a person. See, let me tell you. No sense. You see my brother, Buka? He is better than you. Far, far, far better than, in fact, he's better than you in, in a million times. Better than me in wretchedness, I know. You are very stupid. You are comparing yourself with my brother. Do you have any handwork? Do you have any handwork? Tell me one thing you are proud of in this life. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Try that nonsense again. Okay, what is it? It's not this local he goes. Comparing himself with my brother, my sweet brother, my smart brother. Imagine. Fool. I was running an errand for my mother, and this idiot kept shouting my name from the village square. Eh? I stopped and he started talking rubbish. Okay. 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 You know, anytime I go backward and, and comes forward, something bad happens. Okay. You have been calling me names and I've been condoning it. Okay. But you want to have more many names here again. I will deal with you. <laughs> Why is not like it? James, you are foolish. You are a fool. You are, in fact, monkey. Hey! Hey, Gambia. Yes, you are useless. Madam, you are comparing yourself with my brother. Madam, James, see. you are looking for trouble. You won't like the outcome. Please leave. I respect yourself. Who is holding me? Look at this one. Where did you come from? Did you appear here? Eh? You were here? See, I will beat this stupid girl. I will beat her, and nothing will happen here. And if you put hand, I will, I will, in fact, the breeze of my hand, it will carry you into the into the. Where are you? Look at this gear! Eh? Try me, James! What is your 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 What is your
Now, what is, why are you blocking my way? Why are you blocking, why are you blocking my way? What is your way? You are very stupid. You are very stupid. What is it? Boy! Boy! Ile, please stop talking to such idiots. He can beat you up and leave the village. Make sure you avoid him. Be cool. Who? James. Beat me. James is a nobody. He cannot do anything. If he tries it, he cannot. He cannot break him. Because I know my brother will just warn him and go. But you see, he cannot. He cannot. In fact, he cannot hear about this. Let it end here. Just behave as if nothing happened. It's not everything we should be reporting. Mm. Mm -hmm. okay, no problem. How about your brother and the police? Ah, that one is, is a no story now. Mm. He's already out from the station. But you see Okoro and his arrogance. It will put him in trouble one day. And I know my brother will not forgive him. You see it. Just because uh, his mother retired as a policewoman, any small issue, you now call police for somebody. Is Okoro's mother still alive? Ah, uh -uh. Yes, now. She's there going to court with the husband's family. See, we even heard that her husband is not Okoro's biological father. See, wait, though. Don't say it out, Biko. I beg you, please. Just keep it between us, Biko. You can do court out of one. I'm begging you. Because, my friend, please. Sure. Stories from the background are silly. Please come to my house much later. We have a lot to gist about. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You don't mean it. You don't like gist. I beg good, you're not that your kind of gist. Don't worry now. Let me. Let's go. Ayana, let's go. Now. Hello? Ebuka, what is it? What is it? Neka. Why can't you let Cynthia be? What is it? Why are you disturbing her life? Ebuka, you are talking rubbish. You are talking nonsense. Let her be, oh. Let her be. She's happy without you. Why don't you just leave her alone? Nonsense. N can you imagine? I can someone be, be, be broke and senseless at the same time? Onyala. Ebuka kobo kobo. Cynthia. What have I done to you? Why are you doing this to me? What have I done to deserve this? After all I have done for you. Why? Why? Come in. Yeah. What are we doing here? So, uh, this is your new apartment. You like it? No. You are joking. No, I'm not. So, I wanted some level of privacy between us because it was not convenient visiting you at your friend's place. So, I decided to rent you this apartment. Yeah, I know you'd like it. No! Well, it has three bedrooms upstairs. You want to see? The kitchen is there. Three bedrooms upstairs. It's quite spacious.
So tell me, why are you staring at me? You've been staring. I can't thank you enough for everything you have been doing for me. I appreciate you. Cynthia, didn't I tell you I'll do anything in my power to ensure that you graduate from school? I know how bad your business has been these past days. You even complain to my hearing sometimes. Yeah. But the truth is you mean so much to me. I care about you a lot and uh, I promise you, regardless of my situation right now, I'll do everything to ensure that I put you in a good place. You must graduate from school, I promise you, okay? Ipka, I love you. And I promise to love you forever. I love you too, Cynthia. Now eat your food before it gets cold. Okay, you need to calm down, okay? I'll be with you shortly. On my way, on my way. Okay, alright. Just calm down, calm down. Listen, you have to stop crying, okay? Crying wouldn't solve anything. Besides, your mother is going to be fine. And you need to go to school. You need to go to school. Staying away from school, I mean, that's not good for you. How can I stop crying? How do you expect me to stop crying? When my mother is in the hospital and the doctor said, we need to deposit the sum of 100,000 Naira before he commences treatment. Ebuka, where do I get such amount of money from? My sister is still very young. She doesn't have such amount of money. What do I do? You have me. Telling me to go to school now is a no-no for Cynthia, me. Cynthia, I said I'll take care of it. I'll pay your mother's bills. It's not a problem. I said I'll pay your mother's bills. Let's shoot for me. It's alright. Let's shoot. It's okay. Your mother will be fine, okay? Nothing is going to happen to her. I promise you. Um, wh where, where is the hospital? The village. Oh, your village. Oh, okay. Then we have to go. Let's go. Let's go and see your mother. Thank you. You're welcome. Let me get 
get my back. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, Otuchi, how are you? What? What happened? Mama? What happened to her? What happened to her? When? Fainted? Okay, you know what? Listen, just calm down. Calm down, it's okay. Okay, fine. That. See, stop crying. Can you kindly take her to the hospital? I'll come to the village tomorrow. Okay, she listen to me. Take her to the hospital. I'll be in the village tomorrow. Okay, thank you. My love, what is it? My mother. M my sister just called me now that she's unconscious, that she fainted. <sighs> What kind of decision is this? What is really happening? You have to go and see her. Yeah, but not today because I have to see your mother. I'll go to the village tomorrow. Are you sure you can do this? Yes, we have to go to the hospital to see your mom, right? Thank you. It's okay, get into the car. What's that food? I'm not hungry. I don't feel like eating anything. Ibuka, I noticed you've been thinking too much of late. Why are you doing this to yourself? How can you be thinking all day without eating anything? You want to starve to death? At least eat food so you can have strength to continue your thinking if that's what you truly want. Why is life so unfair to me? This is not the end of the road for you. You have to be positive. You have to believe. Oh, who can't even do any success? You can't starve yourself today. You have to eat, no matter how small. Oh. No one could rescue me except you, Lord. Be a Nikabu Wobi, my eyes are fixed on you, Lord. I'm fine, I'm fine. Lazy youth. <laughs> I never Lazy. be a lazy youth child. Oh my god. Hey, hey babes. Hmm? That idiot called me today. Which of the idiots? How many idiots do you know in your life? Thank you. Ebuka Kobo Kobo. He called me. <laughs> You mean Chukwebuka called you? Yes, he did. I was surprised he has graduated from disturbing you alone. He has now included me in his disturbances. 
I hope you gave him what he asked for. Don't you trust your girl again? I finish him. Mm -hmm. He will never, I don't think he will ever call me again. Very good. You're a darling. Thank you so much. <laughs> Why are you thanking me? For delivering the package Chukwe Buka asked for. <laughs> what kind of stupidity was that? Eh? Babe, honestly, I never had an atom of idea that Chukwe Buka is foolish. It's been months of ignoring Chukwe Buka. Months of not taking his calls or talking to him. A reasonable man would have used his tongue to count his teeth. But Chukwe Buka is only different. His tongue has been cut off. What did you just say? Cynthia, sometimes you, you baffle me. Honestly, you just said a reasonable man. Is Chukwe Buka a reasonable man? It is obvious he is not. Thank you. He should keep disgracing his family members. Mm. You have come out. There is food in the kitchen. Go and eat. Please, what did you cook? I made your favorite. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. Welcome. Oh, welcome, my Accept you, Lord. Be a Nikabu Wobi. About to treat your sick mother. Yeah? Despite the, the money you are owing me. Yeah? As it is your, your sick mother. And you, you still have the rights. The infantry to fight me. You are still talking. You are still talking. By the time I'm done with you, you call soldiers. You call the police. Okay, it's okay. You call the police to arrest me. I can leave him. I can leave him. It's okay. I can Hold him. You go now. What's your problem? You see, huh? Okay. You get that? You get that? I can't. It's okay. Okay, Ebuka, you are still fighting me, Abi. You go, go. Why didn't you go? Ebuka, I'll come back for you. Let's go, please. Ebuka, this time, man. Eh? You were not in jail. Believe me. Ebuka. But do not worry yourself. Hi, Barono. Don't worry. Eh? I will go to their house and speak to the mother. Eh? What type of stupid act is this? See, if he continues to fight you, if he dare fight you again, hey, no, 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 no. It, it will cause more harm. Listen, he should go and thank Ikenna. Yes. If not for Ikenna, mm -hmm. I would have removed all of his teeth. Hey, I'm bad, I'm again. Yes. I know you. Listen, you should go and warn Ebuka to be very careful with me. You should be very careful with me in this village. Hmm? What am I still waiting for? Let me go back to the police. Uh, 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 I will uh, go to the uh, police station. Uh, I'll call all on you. Call huh? No, I told you don't bother yourself. Don't worry. Yeah? Don't worry. I told you, do not bother yourself anymore. No need involving the police anymore. No need involving the police again. We will settle it once and for all. You asked us to come here. Uh -huh. I thought you had some other place in mind. Kwezoku, don't you like this place? It's better we stay here now than allowing you to, to be in that house and, 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 be, and be thinking your life out. 
You've been thinking too much lately. That's why I say we should just take a stroll. And that reminds me, I think I remembered where we should go. Where is that? There's a football match going on today in the field. Let's go and watch. I don't feel like going. I feel like going back home. I will not allow you to go back. In fact, you'll not go back home today till you're done with me. Let's go. No, but I don't... Let's go. Really? Not... Yes, I don't want to go down. But I want to go back home. Let's go. Why are you dragging me like that? Because I don't want you to be thinking. Okay, wait. We're going to take away high I have to. See, I have to go back home. Okay, man. Right. You don't want to ask Are you sure you're not cheating? You're the one who's cheating because you keep winning. That's because I know how to play this game more than you. No, you're winning because it's been a long time I played this game. Don't worry, I'm still warming up. Mm, yes. You're now a car. Okay. <laughs> okay. 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 Mm. Okay. Play now. Oh, I'm, I'm going to play. Hold on. Hold on. Let me just let me arrange my. My bullets. Okay. Mm. Yes. I need that. Hey, I have it. <laughs> I need that. Oh, I have it. There you go. Hold on. Continue. Okay. Give me a second. Let me fire my shot. There you go. Mm. Yes. I need triangle. Triangle? Uh. <laughs> okay. hey. I don't have it. Go to the market then. Quickly! Are you done? I need the uh, circle. I need cross. Hey, why why do you just point my game? You don't have it. No! What are you looking at? Hold on. Continue. Ah, at the back. Alright, let me give you another one. Get ready for my mix out. Get ready, get ready, get ready, get ready, get ready, get ready. I think you Don't you think you should get yourself something doing? Eh? Eh, now it's not good to stay idle at all, though. Very correct. That's true. But the truth is, I don't have enough capital to start up a business. Start small. Start small. Eh, we're not talking about the money we use to buy car or build mansion. Money will be to solve small small problems save from the business and be able to start up a big one that you make big money from so start something it's not good to stay like this space in around now or the child my is not good it's not good for a man to be I even a woman said I didn't make it yet you have a point thank you when you start up something now, why are you now? In our future, money will be coming. And you'll be saving money. You know, we're charming. Mama? Yeah. I can't continue to depend on you. Yeah. It's not fair. Yeah. There was a time you were taking very good care of me. You gave me everything, even without me asking. All but I you know, busy that I I didn't have to ask you for anything. You knew the right thing to do. I mean, look at this house. You built it for your mother. Oh, 
have no who go is can leg and What else can a mother ask for? So now that you have financial uh, uh, challenges, I should turn my back on you. Ah, no, no. This is the time to do the bits that I can. That little money I get from selling vegetables, I will manage it and uh, survive on it <coughs> until whenever. Mama, I, I actually want to start up a, a small business in this village. <laughs> Yelle! Uncle Amakan, that's a good one. It was Chinelo's idea. <laughs> Chinelo's idea. I like the fact that both of you are getting on very well. Ah, Chinelo. That girl is God sent to me. It's your boy. I'm going to get Chinelo. Merafia. Chinelo. Do you know it's so hard to, it's so difficult to forget Cynthia. Each time I try, I just can't. I, sometimes I feel like crying. Everything is like a shock to me. Ibuka, Ibuka, I want you to see this as something good. A woman that can leave you when things become bad for you can kill you if you marry her tomorrow. But I still love her. I still do. What about Chinelo? Okay, now who is Chinelo? The one I always see you with. Come on. Chinelo and I don't have anything. We're just friends. I think she loves you. <sighs> It's possible she does, but I don't love her. Besides, I can't bring myself down to date a common local village girl like hey, her. Hey, shut up. You just shut up. You that just left this village a few years ago now sees us as village people. Eh? Try it. Well, I've suffered. I've really suffered. But I have I'm fun. just saying that we don't have anything. Besides, we're not... Okay, yes. Aren't these mama's clothes she's washing? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. She normally come around to wash them. <laughs> and you're happy about that? Huh? Hey, Buka, there's nothing wrong with me washing mama's clothes. Oh. Mama is like my own biological mother. And I see nothing wrong with me washing my mother's clothes. You know, go. Happier. Oh, can see a sabakwa. Wow. Ogechi, you should be ashamed of yourself. You're happy that another person is washing your mother's clothes. What is it now? You should be ashamed of... See, hey, if you, I'm going to give you a dead slap now. You should be ashamed of yourself. Someone, someone is helping you wash your mother's clothes. Shut up! Big head. Try it again. Mama, 
when are you giving me the money you promised me? Give me for the next program. Hey, what? That is no problem. When is the program coming up? The last Sunday of the month. Ah. Mr. Wadjo, on your way to church this Sunday, just let me know and I'll give you the money. Thank you, Mama. Mama, Hola. that's not going to happen in this house. Uh, why? You're giving her nothing. Not until she finds something very important to do and stops lazing around. I'm not lazy, I'm not lazy. I'm not telling you I'm not lazy. But what makes you think your sister is lazy? Mama, isn't it obvious? It's very obvious. When was the last time you washed Mama's clothes? <laughs> when was the last time you helped Mama do her laundry? Nabul Manka, eh? Chinelo has taken over. Oh, Chinelo Buzi, no. One person that has decided to wash all my clothes whenever they get that. Mama, is that supposed to be so? Is that the right thing to do when your daughter is here? Someone else is washing your clothes or do your laundry for you? Uh, well, the thing is, the first day I met her, she was so nice to me. From that day, she was coming around, helping me, doing all sorts for me. She didn't even know I had children. She thought I had nobody to help me, not knowing that I have a handsome son in the city. And you know, <laughs> she didn't even know about Ogechi until she came back from Enu. That's good though. But listen, in the north where I did my youth service, girls like you already have four children. <laughs> be here and be following mama everywhere. How about four children with ex for her, four ex-husbands? Hey, also quick on my go quiet master call mistress. Anyway, Nanya. Chinelo is really a nice person, honestly. Especially when you get to know her very well. Hardworking, helpful, loving, determined. Ah, Uncle? Chinelo. Uncle. Are you going out? Yes, Uncle. Hey. I have a very important thing to discuss with you. Uncle, as you can see, I was already on my way out before your arrival. Are Please. You, are you saying that? That place you're going is more important to what I'm about to tell you. Uncle, but you never told me you wanted to have a conversation with me earlier. I had already booked this appointment. Biko, let me go. I will come to your house once I'm back. Oh, you go. Here. Mwana, uncle. Go anywhere, oh. Manka. She didn't even want to know what I'm about to say. Eh, hey, okay. Adamma. Agaracham was come back. When you go, you come back. I'm waiting. Ah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Your sister is not yet back. No, she's not back. So what you I'm going out. I'm going to the church for um, women's meeting. Uh, what can you come. Eh? I'm going for a women's meeting. Mama. Hey. Ha. Ah, baby. You're going now. Yes. Hey, can you to the church? All right. Uh, we have the women's meeting. All right, Mama. I'm going. All right. Mama. Uh -huh. Take care of yourself. I will. I'm going. Ah, Evuka. How are you? You think, say, you savvy, just watch and see, what thing go happen, no. You think, say, you dead smart, just watch and see, God did not be man, no. You keep staring at me. What is it? You're so beautiful. I know. Thank you. <laughs> you think, say, you're sappy? Just watch.
Will you marry me? You think say you this marks? Just watch and see. God, you wanna go meet? question go ahead why are some women so attracted to money that they pretend to be in love when there is money <laughs> that attitude is for cheap girls so I'm telling you the truth it's for cheap women it's only a cheap woman that will pretend to love you when you have money and suddenly change when it seems like things are not working the way she 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 expects the water. It's not a good character. Cheap. It's not. Cheap. Mm -hmm. Cheap women, now. Nah. Somebody without integrity. Oh, Mumeha. Because if, if, you, if you know who you are and you have value for yourself, you will love a man genuinely from your heart. May God the Maduro. But why did you suddenly ask me this question? Nothing. Yeah, just forget I asked you. I feel good. I feel good. I feel Proven to be the real man. Sure. <laughs> Long lasting proposal. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, this is so beautiful. Thank you. And <laughs> <laughs> mm. it's expensive too, you know. Of course. Trust my Gerald, he doesn't do small things. He likes doing them massive. <gasps> Wanna go? Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Oh. <laughs> I'm so happy for you. Trust Thank me, you, I'm so love. happy for Thank you. you. <laughs> I'm here now. He said you want to discuss something important. Please sit. I wanted to see you because I do hit my chest with proud that my brother's daughter is now a woman. Not just a woman, but a beautiful woman. Thank you, Uncle. But one thing is missing. You need a man in your life. A man that will love and care for you. Oh. I, I, I think I know the man. His name is Dan. Ichia Agota. Son that plays football at Broad. 
Uncle, thank you so much for your care and concern. Hmm. I appreciate you, like I said before. But the truth is, you cannot love me more than the way I love myself. I know what is best for me. I am not ready right now. So, Biko, tell your footballer Suto that I'm not ready. Hello. Yes, Uncle. Thank you. Oh, oh I have to, Uncle, I have to be on my way. God bless you. Uncle, you can me Oh, bye bye. Oh, go. <laughs> he thinks she's a kid and talking about marriage to her looks as if you're pouring a death on her but she must leave that house nobody trusts in my family <laughs> uh, my brother, days are gone when parents forces their children to get married, especially when they have not seen their choice. Uh, I will advise you allow her to make a choice. You see, if today the, gov the country is not stable, you see men hustling here and there to feed themselves first before looking for a second person to feed. Uh, no, okay, as it is now. My daughters are here with me. Are you now advising me to send them away? But the, the answer is no. Your daughters are still kids. <laughs> Sooner or later, Chinelo will get to her monopause. And you're telling me to calm down. No. Her father, who is my brother, is no more. Eh? And uh, I should do what he ought to do if he is still here. You are saying the same thing. I will still advise you to take it easy with her. At no distant time, she will get her own man at the God's appointed time. A good man for that matter. Anyway, that is by the way. <laughs> anyway, um, you said James has not been here to tender apology for touching your daughter, yes? Of course, I've not seen him. Well, I've done the best I could. I only allow the gods to deal with him. But how can this boy or man or what you call him be constituting nuisance to everybody in this community? Huh? Is it not better for him to die and we look for a shallow grave and bury him? No, calm down. Calm down. It has not gotten to that level. Mm. Yes. I will look for him and I'll talk to him. You better do. Please. Because I will not leave him. I will teach him the lesson of his life. That's my word. James. You are a bad boy. And it is high time we elders uproot you from this mother earth so that you will go and dine and wine with the ancestors since you don't want to be useful to your life. Which one is that that's want to uproot me again? Mazi, what did I do again? Come. You don't know what you did. I do not know. I don't, I don't know what I did. You better go to Mazio Udeque's house and tender your apologies for Lifting the your filthy hands on his daughter. <laughs> if not, go and buy your coffin. Because the days he gave you have passed. You know how mean that man is. Not only coffin. I will buy the mortuary. I will even plan for my own burial. Nonsense. See, that man will not do anything. Okotuku, his daughter, slapped me. Just that by the, the self defense was like attacked. It was a very, very powerful slap. Now the old man is threatening to, to, to kill me. See, let him come and kill me. After all, sometimes if I wake up, I'll be asking myself. It's when I see another woman being, when I touch the person and feel the body, that's when I will be convicted and still alive. If he kills me, my life doesn't have any meaning now. So it will be a, it will be a good thing for him to kill me himself. Your mouth is rolling up and down like a grass cutter. Inchi. 
八八八八八八八八八八，哎呀，富安呀，哎呀，多吉吉。In fact， 哎呀，当卡呀。I am telling you. Man, I don't, I don't understand these things you are saying that I will eat. I talk about my child. I talk, I talk about my cafe. Now, try to do something about yourself. Okay. I go do too much, my brother. And if it's, if it's because of that old man, he will not do anything. Don't worry. Man, okay. Is that why uh, the elders was being me to so approach me? I will go and die and with my ancestors. It's useful that I follow to your ancestors. You are not useful to the community. Exactly. So you better die. Look at you, old man <laughs> like you, you are still a messenger. <laughs> you cannot, you are a messenger. I am saying the truth. You're but you have it. not started even, you don't know how your life will be. You are in between. Man, the only reason I, I'm, I'm respecting you because I'm, I know I will eat rice in your burial <laughs> and, it, and it's coming Me, up very soon. When Mazu Dekwe kills you, nobody will bury you. At least I know who that they will call, but you are, we don't know who they will call to say, who owns this one? You are a leftover. I'm sorry for you. I'm a leftover? Yes. Mazi, go and bring them to come and kill me. How they have grown. Okay. And what even they do, eh? Okay. Mazi, see, he's coming now. You should be uprooting plants. You are trying to uproot, uh, uproot a young man that did not do anything to against you. Man, that is useless. I only uh, snapped in self-defense. Oh. Not that the slap uh, managed to tear one care for the man here. That's why everybody wants to kill me. Nonsense. That's why I'm not going to shake a whole I said, no, I'm a threat. You kill me. Ha! And when did you do it? All is well. Yes, there's no problem. Everything is fine. Oh, okay. Uh, um, I actually wanted to let you know that sometimes disappointments in life could lead you to your blessing. That's true. That's true. Good. Mama, I strongly believe that all the challenges I've been facing is leading me to a greater blessing. That is good. Yes. Good to hear. Ah, uh, you, you know. That girl you wanted to marry, Cynthia Kwafia. <laughs> she came here a couple of times, and um, as at then, I thought she was a good girl. But now we all know that she's not as good as we thought. Mama, honestly speaking, I'm equally very surprised about Cynthia. But the truth is, I've gotten over her. I've moved past that situation. That is good to hear. We've moved past it. Yes. Well, the only thing I really wanted to tell you is that since you've moved past Cynthia, I think it's about time you started thinking of getting married to Chinelo. Hmm? Chinelo. Which Chinelo? Chinelo Canyon that comes and goes. Chinelo. Uh-huh. The village girl. Yes, now. Ah, if you're in a village, in a Mama, for a second, I thought you were calling me for something important. Hey, Buka. So if I'm not going to call you, what could be more important than trying to find a good wife for your son? Eh? I mean, they could. They will make such a beautiful couple. Mesia no mufa. Why are you here? How are you? Calm down. I came to see you. To see me for what? Calm down. I came to see you. For what exactly? Didn't my uncle Menka tell you that I am not interested? Okay, let me tell you now. I will not and I will never marry you. 
don't understand young men of these days. I don't, I cannot explain it. You want to marry a woman. Instead of you to walk directly and approach a woman, the Kadimpa, you went to talk to my uncle first, bribed him to talk to me. Instead of approaching me directly to tell me how you feel about me, what kind of a man does that? How can you marry me when you lack boldness? I heard you're a footballer. So how do you not have the mind to attack football when you cannot approach a woman you truly desire to have as a wife? Mokem, okay. I am not interested. Please, just get out. I understand. And I'm sorry. I didn't actually think you would feel this way about it. I didn't think so. But you see, I have the money. Eh? I'll take very good care of you. All you just have to do is say yes to me. And I promise you I'll make you the most happiest woman on earth. Aww. Eh, Chi? 